Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the coolest, craziest, or most legendary surges of strength in all of Dragon Ball. Ally to good! Nightmare to you! Number 20, Orange Piccolo. Piccolo. Most of the time, getting beaten to a pulp and slammed into a pit isn't a great way to win a fight. But no need to worry, Piccolo had a backup plan by the name of Shenron. All you had, plus a bit extra. The wish-granting dragon unlocked the Namekian's latent potential, and the results are plain to see. Erupting from a pillar of orange energy, Piccolo's return to the battlefield is the very definition of epic. If you want to know just how strong this form is, look no further than the fact that Piccolo doesn't even flinch at Gamma 2's attacks anymore. Its resident Namekian was long overdue a transformation, and thankfully, Orange Piccolo's debut was worth the wait. Well now, thank you, Shenron. That little extra went a long way. Number 19, Golden Frieza. Frieza. Over the years, there's been a lot of gilded transformations in Dragon Ball, from Goku, Gohan, Vegeta, and yes, even Frieza. If I hadn't evolved to a new level myself, then this might have proven rather perilous for me. But although we've already seen the space tyrant try on the golden look, this scene sells the weight of the power-up like never before. The sharp and detailed animation fills the screen with so much gold, the glow of it can literally be seen from space. It's more than a mere paint job, though. The only thing cooler than the transformation itself is watching Frieza use his new power to utterly obliterate the poor assassins. I know gold's a bit gauche, but I wanted to ensure you grasp my new position atop the pecking order. After a power boost like this, those guys never stood a chance. <laughs> Number 18, Super Saiyan 3, Gotenks. What's a transformation without some dramatic flair? To Goten and Trunks, the answer is nothing. That's why when Push came to shove, they still held onto their trump card until the very end. I was just trying to make the fight more fantastic. If you would have let me, I could have taken care of Majin Buu and we'd be on the outside now. You blew it! You won! It's only when they're trapped in the hyperbolic time chamber with the fate of the Earth hanging in the balance that they finally unveil Super Saiyan 3 in all its glory. On principle, the roar that triggers the iconic golden mullet just can't be beat. But it's even more memorable because of how much character is packed into its hilarious context. In the end, Gotenks got their wish. They saved the day and looked damn cool while doing it. Your body, you've been transformed! <laughs> you like the new look? You should. <laughs> Number 17, Evil Boo, Majin Boo. You really don't want to make this guy mad, not just because Boo's an all-powerful villain with no moral compass, but also because he has some serious anger management issues. Tell me who you are first! Me, Boo! Majin Boo! You fool, I'm Majin Boo! <laughs> So much so that Majin Buu's fury manifests into a whole other version of himself. That's right, two Boos for the price of one, and neither is particularly friendly. But as if the grey-skinned evil Boo wasn't frightening enough, he then eats his original form, transforming again into the new and improved Super Boo. Each form is scarier, cooler, and more insane than the last. But from a character like Boo, we shouldn't be surprised. <laughs> Number 16, Legendary Super Saiyan, Broly. With one key blast and one hell of a monologue, Frieza triggered one of the most iconic Super Saiyan transformations in decades. Now what if we said that was just the start? It's your father! He was killed by a stray energy blast! <clears throat> Dragon Ball Super Broly doesn't skimp in the animation department, and that's no clearer than when its title character finally lives up to his potential. There's no other way to put it, Broly's explosive final transformation is a pure spectacle through and through. 
but rest assured, it's got some serious power behind it too. Not just anyone can keep up with Gogeta himself. After witnessing Broly's jaw-dropping strength, it's obvious why they call him the legendary Super Saiyan. Number 15, Super Saiyan God, Goku. To unlock the red hair dye, it took a threat to Earth, an ancient ceremony, and the power of five Saiyans. Yet, somehow, Super Saiyan God was worth it all. Trading golden hair for a divine aura, this new style proved that Goku could still tussle with the best of them, even literal destroyer gods. So tell me, how does it feel becoming a god? It's incredible. While the red hairdo is certainly a nice change of pace, the real meat of this glow-up comes from Goku's high-flying spat with Beerus. In just one fight, Super Saiyan God earned itself a place as one of the most impressive Saiyan skills to date, and there's a lot of them. Paid your strength because it's not yours. That's right. That's a sign of pride. It will be your downfall. Number 14, Super Saiyan Rose. Goku Black By Dragon Ball Super, we'd pretty much seen the whole Saiyan rainbow. But then, Goku Black came along. Instead of the standard gold, red, or blue, the doppelganger went with pink. And just like that, Super Saiyan Rose was born. What do you think of it? Quite the color, huh? The look on Trunks and Vegeta's face says it all. This is unlike anything we've seen before. It's new, it's intimidating, and most of all, it's stylish as hell. As a test drive, Goku Black dices through Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta like it's a warm-up. Super Saiyan Rose isn't the last new form introduced in the future Trunks arc, but it's still the most memorable. But I'll show you how far I've come. Say what? <laughs> Number 13, Super Saiyan, Trunks. Go on! Back in the day when classic Super Saiyan still meant something, few debuts did it as well as Trunks's. Taking place in a timeline devastated by the androids, you can practically feel the Saiyan's heartbroken rage, especially since he's sitting over the body of his dead mentor, Gohan. The rain, the music, the voice acting, all together it's an emotional gut punch you simply can't look away from, no matter how hard you try. There's not many transformations in all of Dragon Ball that are this tragic, but then again, that's precisely why Trunks turning Super Saiyan is one for the history books. Number 12, Super Saiyan 4, Goku. What's that transformation I sense? Love or hate it, at least something good did come out of Dragon Ball GT. After a less than stellar 34 episodes, things finally started to pick up halfway through the baby saga. After transforming into Golden Uzaru, audiences were treated to a brief look into Goku's fractured mind before Super Saiyan 4 is unleashed. The design is pretty divisive, but the experience was sweet all the same, due to how long fans were left waiting to see Goku as an adult once again. Yes! He did it! <laughs> Number 11, Ultra Instinct, Goku. A precursor to the awesomeness to come. Dragon Ball Super's Universe Survival Arc does not lack capable warriors, with Universe 11's Jiren being absurdly strong. After overpowering Goku and returning his spirit bomb, the Saiyan loses consciousness and falls right into the massive ball of energy. At first, people assume the worst, before Goku is reborn in an entirely new form. The shimmering aura proves to be the tipping point needed to finally put Jiren and his universal cronies on the back step. Number 10, Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken, Goku. Once Super Saiyan was introduced, Kaioken quickly became obsolete. 
Created by King Kai, Goku successfully uses the technique multiple times during the Saiyan and Namek sagas. I am still figuring it out. At this point, I only have about a 1 in 10 chance of pulling it off. Fast forward more than two decades and the power-up is suddenly resurrected for Dragon Ball Super. In the final battle of the Universe 6 tournament, the assassin Hit has Goku on the ropes, so the Saiyan activates Kaioken while in his Super Saiyan Blue form. Quite the color combo. I know it's risky, but there's a big payoff too! Number 9. Final Form Frieza <laughs> Self-proclaimed ruler and Dragon Ball's baddest of bads, King Cold's second son is arguably the most iconic villain of the franchise. Born with enough power to destroy entire planets, Frieza did not need to train a single day in his life. While fighting Vegeta on Namek, the sadistic ruler goes through a handful of transformations, with each one being bigger than the last. After announcing there is one more change, Toriyama subverted expectations by having Frieza's final form be way smaller but much scarier. Number 8. Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan Vegeta You can always count on Vegeta to take a moment of despair and turn it into a crowd pleaser. With Goku laying helpless on the floor, Frieza summons Vegeta and asks him to prove his allegiance by killing off Kakarot. But I've already made my decision. I'm going to pulverize you until there's nothing left. <laughs> Instead, the prince transforms effortlessly into Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan, more commonly known now as Super Saiyan Blue, wiping the smirk off Frieza's face. No, this can't be real! Considering Vegeta used to be terrified of the tyrant, this role reversal provided much needed closure. <laughs> Number 7. Perfect Cell Cell Yes, Cell's final transformation is at last at hand. Soon he will be the greatest adversary I have ever faced! Vegeta's pride ruins the day once again. Semi-perfect Cell was far from a pushover, but Vegeta and Trunks had the upper hand during their fight. Unfortunately, the Saiyan Prince prioritized his own ego and refused to deliver the final blow until Cell achieved perfection. After swallowing up Android 18, we are treated to a mesmerizing light show as the villain slowly reveals his final form. As one of the best villains in the franchise, this transformation is fondly remembered as a standout moment of the series. <laughs> Number 6. Beast Gohan Gohan Shattering your limits must run in the family. When both his daughter and Piccolo are put on the chopping block, Gohan becomes so angry he gets a new kind of power all to himself. And of course, it comes with one hell of a jaw-dropping debut. That all you've got? <laughs> okay then, guess it's my turn. Gohan's enraged roar is, well, bestial. With a power level as big as his new hair, the beast form is the best part of Gohan's character, all wrapped into one spine-tingling fight scene. Fittingly, it's against none other than Cell Max. Just try not to blink through it. Beast Gohan is so overpowered, our only complaint is we wanted to see more of it. Special Theme Canada! Number 5. Super Saiyan Vegeta Well, better late than never. I'll finish these androids, but then you're next, got it? After seeing Goku and Trunks beat him to the punch, Vegeta finally manages to turn Super Saiyan after pushing himself to near death. As far as transformations go, this one is rather short and straight to the point. With the prince delivering his classic one-liners before powering up. 
I didn't care about anything. And then it happened. While still very much in his arrogant anti-hero phase, witnessing Vegeta attain this level of strength was quite something, especially with the beatdown that followed. I am the prince of all Saiyans once again. Enough of this nonsense, fool. Number four, Mastered Ultra Instinct. Goku, you know you're doing something right when even the gods of destruction stand to offer their respect. Throughout the Tournament of Power, Goku's uphill fights against Jiren pushed him to near divine levels of strength. And in the 11th hour, it all paid off in a scene that speaks for itself. Sporting incredible build-up and top-rate animation, the unveiling of Mastered Ultra Instinct is by and large the crowning moment of all Dragon Ball Super. It manages to culminate the tournament, Goku's character, and the entire arc of the show in one breathtaking moment. Even if Goku surpasses his limits again one day, there will never be anything quite like Ultra Instinct. Autonomous Ultra Instinct! Number 3. Super Saiyan 2. Gohan. Everyone has a breaking point. Don't think you can beat me just by powering up. A sensitive and quiet boy, Goku's son does not really enjoy fighting, but he is willing to do anything to protect those important to him. <laughs> Look at what you've done! Perfect Cell spends episode after episode tormenting Gohan to try and awaken his real power before the death of Android 16 sends the young Saiyan over the deep end. Incredible. From Super Saiyan 2's electrifying design to that bone-chilling scream, Cell got more than he bargained for and then some. Number 2. Super Saiyan. Goku. I won't let you. It's the form that changed everything. Prior to this historic transformation, fans were still waiting to see if the legendary Super Saiyan myth held any water. Believing that Goku's fierce spirit bomb put Freezer down for the count, Krillin and Piccolo are defenseless as the tyrant launches a counterattack. Uh, it's Freezer! Fueled by the explosive death of his best friend, Goku loses control and taps into his inner Saiyan, going golden in the process. Even today, this scene still gives us goosebumps. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure to go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Super Saiyan 3 Goku the scream to end all screams. Super Saiyan 3 might be Goku's least utilized form, but the transformation was beyond perfect. And this, what he doing, is to go even further beyond. While most power-ups tend to happen out of nowhere and rather quickly, Goku achieved Super Saiyan 3 deliberately after around five minutes of build-up. This sequence is intercut with shots of tsunamis, earthquakes, and a panicking King Kai. No, stop it, Goku! Suggesting Goku's new form might not be the greatest idea given the magnitude of force it is able to exert. But damn if it isn't amazing to behold. <laughs> What's your favorite Dragon Ball power-up? Don't be shy, let us know in those comments below. When you're backed into a corner, Goku, it's almost scary what you're capable of. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from Watch Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.